beginning with 23 ABC's Ivan Rodriguez, who spoke with fans and students after this tough semifinal loss. Ivan. After the game, many Roadrunner fans were proud that the basketball team got so far. Many saying that it helped bring the community even closer together. Fans from across the country had eyes on today's game. Even a family who lived in Bakersfield, now living in New York, and going to support their Roadrunners. I've been a fan of Cal State Bakersfield for around, I'd say about four or five years now. While fans back home who were watching the game say the men's basketball team continue to spread the Bakersfield name nationwide. They put us on the map. Every time that we're on television, every time they see a road runner, every time they see that blue and gold, it can only help the school, it can only help the community. The CSUB basketball team headed to their NIT semifinal game with the support of an entire city. All of us back home watching the game on TV were all behind them. Watch parties were held throughout different bars and restaurants to see if the Roadrunners could pull off yet another win. The last three NIT games were usually up by 20. So when we were not up by 20, I went, oh, this is not good. The kids, I think, did a great job. I think they represented the school well, and uh, they have nothing to be ashamed of. Many fans today, after the loss, believe this team brought the community even closer together. The community is going to support them. As soon as they tell us when they're going to be there, there'll be a crowd at CSUB because they're behind them all the way, win or lose. Students who I spoke with back here at the CSUB campus say they're excited for the team to return, and they're actually scheduled to fly into Bakersfield tomorrow and land around 2.30, and we're going to be there when they do and bring that to you. Live at CSUB, Ivan Rodriguez, 23 ABC News.